take it to the top, take it to the top, take it to the top, take it to the top. That was just a practice run. Now we're gonna really jump into it. Economy ticket. Then we broke down what to expect when you book an economy ticket. Bit. Dang, I almost had it. We got enough hay kids to last us for like a lifetime. Okay, all right, ready. Hey kids, I'm Kamau. I'm Selena. And we're with the city and beyond. In a recent video, we broke down the differences between a basic economy ticket and an economy ticket. And then we broke down what to expect when you book a basic economy ticket. In this video, we're going to talk specifically about United's basic economy policy and how we've survived all the restrictions for so long. So if you've been on a United flight and flown in an economy seat, then congratulations, you've likely had a basic economy experience. And that could be a good thing, or it can be a bad thing. Uh, your mileage may vary. We're most familiar with United's basic economy for a couple of reasons. One being that we live near the third largest United hub in the world. The second reason is, you guessed it, we're United Explorer card holders. So we constantly get back those benefits of having an economy class ticket like all the time. And the third reason is because they are part of the Star Alliance, which means that they're a part of an alliance of 26 airlines. And we get to get miles from all of them if we fly them. So there's plenty of perks in Star Alliance, but we won't list them here now. Next, we're gonna break down the categories of a United Basic Economy flight. Sort of like we did last time, but this one catered specifically to United Airlines. First and foremost, seat assignments. When you book your ticket, they will assign a seat to you at check-in for free. Most times you actually can pick your seat while you are booking your ticket. However, that will also cost you a fee. And for your bag allowance, um, carry-on size is not allowed um, and you don't get a free check-in bag. You only get a personal item and for United, you can see the measurements right here below. Boarding, you're getting on the plane last. Next topic. And cost, basic econ a United basic economy ticket is still cheaper than an economy ticket. Sometimes just not by much. So always compare the two prices before you, you just go in for the basic economy ticket. Now let's talk about how we get the perks that we do with our United Explorer card. Carry-ons and check bags are free. However, they are only free when you book your ticket with the United Explorer card. You can't do it after the fact, you have to do it while you are booking. Next, United Club Passes. Lounges are awesome and they cost money to get in unless you remember with the card. Then they give you two passes every year. It kind of offsets the annual fee for the card and it's a great thing to do, especially when you have like a flight that you have to go in really early or really late. You can just stop in, chill out, and enjoy yourself before your flight. Which is usually a basic economy ticket. The other perk is, you remember how we said in United, you get on the plane last with your basic economy ticket? When you book your ticket with the United Explorer card, you're in group two. Ooh, we get to board first. Why not group one? I'll answer that. That is reserved for first class and business class and basic economy and economy <laughs> is not that. And lastly, for all you uh, mileage and point hackers people out there, when you book with your United Explorer card, you still get partial miles. Whereas when you book a regular basic economy ticket, you are likely to get none. You do lose out some of them with the basic economy, but at least you get something when you book with the ticket. As a bonus, we're going to answer two questions that we get a lot about basic economy and related to United. And the first question is, when should you take advantage of these basic economy tickets? Well, we talked about this a little bit in the last video, very briefly, but one of the ways is taking advantage of the ticket when you have a shorter flight or it's a short distance, or you have a shorter trip or you have a short distance. And that is 
um, you know, like usually family obligations, someone has a milestone birthday, there's a wedding, or unfortunately something like a funeral. You wanna hop on those basic economy tickets. They're cheap, they're quick to usually get, and you'll get to your destination just like everybody else. And another way to take advantage or when it's time to take advantage is when they're really, really cheap. If they're really cheap, like the tickets that we just saw uh, presently at the time of recording this video, uh, $69 to go from New York to North Carolina, take advantage. That, this is the time. This is the time <laughs> to take advantage. Because no matter what fees are applied on top of that, because you wanna select your own seat, or you wanna up, you know, you, like you wanna add a couple of things like a $30 um, baggage fee, which is United's usual baggage fee amount, um, it's still really, really cheap. It's under like $150. Like, so take, that is the time to take advantage. Which brings us to the final point. Is it better than a budget airline? For us, the answer is yes. I'll tell you why. For all the reasons we laid out prior, we love to book our basic economy tickets with United or any major carrier. More times than not, we will do United, uh, but United American Delta, it's perfectly fine because with a basic economy ticket on a major carrier, it is still a major carrier. Whereas on a budget carrier, it's basic economy <laughs> in every single seat. So that alone makes basic economy a better selection when possible. If you found this video helpful, please remember to give us a big old like for this video. And if you have more questions, leave them in the comments below. And remember, check out the previous basic economy video that we referenced earlier in this video. It will explain a lot more about what basic economy is and break down just like we broke down the United basic economy class. We're also gonna have another video about packing for a basic economy flight and you don't wanna miss out on it. So be sure to subscribe, click the notification bell so that you don't miss any of the videos that we have coming up soon. And with all that said, we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye. Really? Sparkle. I feel like you're killing me. Hopefully it can't pick that up. <laughs> Alright. Why do you keep trying to jump on me? Stop trying to jump on me. Okay. That's not... <laughs> We're dog sitting. We're dog sitting. We're dog okay, sitting. Okay, alright. <laughs> Outtakes! <laughs> We're dog sitting. Dog is begging and has a monkey eye right now. So, we got things to do after this. Okay.